Hey everybody, this is GoopGoopSix here, and welcome back to another video in my series, in which I'm playing Win Discs into different game consoles. Today I'm using my AM Grandparents Blu-ray player. I'm just gonna put a Win Disc in it, and see what happens. So obviously to show you this works, I have the Lego Movie on the Blu-ray. Let's just see, yeah, let's just see what happens, let's just open it up. It's a cool feature is that you can actually use the remote to open this thing up. So yeah, just put it there. Yeah, so you just, just close it. There we go. Oops. So there it goes. I don't know if you can see. It's attempting to read it, and there we go. So. Let's go ahead and press. Menu, so probably let's just make sure this does work. This is, keeps on saying now reading. Let's just make sure this does work. There you go. Keeps on coming up with that. the music on the end. There you go, so obviously a Blu-ray movie will work on a Blu-ray player. So let me um, get that out of here. So there we go. So there we go, obviously a Blu-ray movie will work on a Blu-ray player. The, uh, as I said, this is my grandparents' Blu-ray player, so I've just bought some my disc downstairs. So yeah, on that next we're gonna be um, testing a DVD. So this is the road to El Dorado. Obviously, it should also work too. There we go. So let's put it in. So uh, once again, obviously this should work. As you can see, it's speeding the disc. And there you go. Um, so let's make sure it make sure it plays it. Okay. Trying to skip to the menu. It says it says this this operation is not available. Okay. Weird. Let's just make sure. Well, yeah, it doesn't really matter because there's no real, there's no ad, there's no commercial trailers in this. So, but yeah, we're just gonna attempt. Tr we're just gonna try to play the movie just to make sure that this is working. All right, so there we go. All right, so let's just make sure this does work. Up this warning screen. And there you go. As you can see, DVDs do work on Blu ray players. This new firmware is available. Please update firmware and set up. What does that even mean? But yeah, there we go. So, DVDs do work on a Blu ray player. Save so that. So, that one did work. Um, how about a music CD? Let's try. So this is Drake. This should also. This, this should uh, now. This one, um, it should work. Um, yeah, I don't know if all DVD players can play CDs, but this is, so, I'm assuming it's gonna work, because you can see it says music. Yep. So, here we go, we got, we're getting something. And there we go, as you can see, 
CDs do work on the on on a Blu-ray player. However, I'm not gonna play any of the music because I don't want to get copyright. So yeah, there we go. So music CDs do work on this particular Blu-ray player. Put it in. There we go. Well, next we're gonna try the SpongeBob SquarePants typing game for the PC. Let me just. There we go. There we go. Alright. So here goes the SpongeBob SquarePants typing game for the PC. Let's see if it can read it. There we go. As you can see, it's reading. Maybe if we get lucky, you might be able to play the SpongeBob SquarePants. Oh, we're getting something. We're getting something. Oh, there we go. So we get that's in type. So it's recognized it as a. It's recognized it as a media disc. So, so there we go. Um, the SpongeBob SquarePants taping game kind of works. However, you can't actually play the game. So there we go. I can't believe that game. I kind of I can't believe it kind of actually worked. Let's see, let me just put it away. So yeah, I'm, I'm gonna count that that worked. So there we go, so good so far. How about, let's keep it going, let's try an Xbox 360 game. This is Burnout Paradise, this is one of my favorite games on the Xbox 360, right behind Minecraft, as I mentioned in my um, foreign discs in a PS4 video. So, there we go. Right, let's try it. So, um, if so, uh, what should happen is it should, like, just play the splash screen. So, let's see. So, it's trying to load it. There we go. We're getting something. There we go. And then, as you can see, to play this disc, put it in an Xbox 360 console. So, so it will recognize it as a DVD. However, you can't actually play the game. See, I'm gonna... I'm gonna count that as it worked. I'm gonna count that that worked. So yeah, Xbox 360 games. Um, they do work, however you can't actually play the game. So, yeah. yeah cause we, did, we got at least, we got something at least, so. How about an, an Xbox One game? This is NBA 2K19. So let's see if it can, let's see if it can recognize it. It may be amazing if we could, if it could, one second, be able to play, be able to play Xbox One games on, on a Blu-ray player, that'd be amazing if we could do that, so, now let's close it, now let's see if it can recognize it, as you can see it's reading it, let's see, Trying to, I can hear it. It's trying to read. One. All right. So it says cannot read. Please check the disc. So obviously you can't play Xbox One games on a Blu-ray player. Get that out of there. See, once again, Xbox One games don't work. So I'm going to put that right there. How about a PlayStation 2 game? Here we have um, Final Fantasy 12. So that PC game, it, it, recogni it recognized it as a media disc. And on the Xbox 360, it did too. So let's see if we can get this. Let's see what, let's see what we can have done with this. So... There we go, so the PlayStation 2 game is in. Let's see if it can recognize it. So it's reading. And it says, this disc is incompatible. So obviously you can't play PlayStation 2 games on a Blu-ray player. So yeah. So yeah, PlayStation 2 games do not work. 
How about how about the PlayStation three game we have? Is NCAA football fourteen? I don't know. I don't know if any of you even play that game anymore. Yes, this is NCAA football fourteen. My my brother got this as a Christmas present one year. I forget I forget when, but yeah, he got this as a Christmas present, and you can see it's a Blu-ray disc, so it should do some should do something. So there we go. Yeah. So yeah, once again, it is a Blu-ray disc, so it should do something. So as you can see, it's trying to load it up. Wait. Let's see. So as you can see, it is trying to read the disc. Alright. So there we go. Oh. Let's see if anything happens. It says, cannot read, please check the disc. Oh, it's a Blu-ray. It's a Blu-ray disc. <laughs> well, it says, cannot read, so... So, obviously, you can't play PlayStation 3 games on a Blu-ray player. Even though it's a Blu-ray disc. Let's see, it shouldn't work. It's a Blu-ray disc. I guess the... I, can't, I guess I can't read it, so... Yeah. So, yeah, PlayStation 3 games do not work. But how about PlayStation 4 game? We got... This is Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. Let's see if we can recognize it. That'd be amazing if it did so. So once again, this is also a Blu-ray disc, so it might it might do something. Yeah. So yeah, once again, yes, this is a this is a Blu-ray disc, so maybe if we get lucky, it will recognize it. So as you can see, it's trying to read. So all of a sudden this went silent, so So I might do something because this is a Blu-ray disc, so on a Blu-ray disc player, so and it's a Blu-ray disc, so to do something. Alright. Can't see that anything is happening. Let's see. As is the same thing that I did with the Xbox One and PlayStation 3 game. Cannot read. Please check the disc. So obviously you can't play PlayStation 2 games on a Blu-ray player. Wait. Not PlayStation 2. PlayStation 4. But yeah. This did the same thing that it did with an Xbox One and PlayStation 3 game. So. Yeah. Unfortunately. A Blu-ray disc. Blu-ray discs do well. On PlayStation Four games don't work. How about let's try a Wii game? This is Mario Super Sluggers. You got the, I got this for my eleventh birthday. It's a pretty good game. If you haven't played it. I would probably recommend it. So yeah, the tray is open. So let's see if I can recognize a Wii game. So there we go. There we go. So. There we go. So the Wii game is in. Let's see if it can recognize it. Alright. And and it immediately does the same thing that it did with an Xbox One, PlayStation 3, and PlayStation 4 game. Cannot read, please check the disc. So obviously you cannot play Wii games on a Blu-ray player. So yeah. Once again, the Wii game you cannot, you can't. Wii games do not work. But how about a Wii U game? Oh no, that's not that's not Wii U. We have Mario Party Ten. Let's see if I can recognize it. There. So. All right. So let's see here. There we go, so, the, the Wii U game is in, as you can see, it's trying to read it, let's see, so, it's attempting to load it up, fulfilling it's gonna do the same thing that I did with a PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and Wii game.
Yep. You cannot read, please check the disc. So, obviously, Wii U games are not working. One second, guys, I'll be right back. Oh, what are you doing down here? Okay, sorry about that, guys. My cat just came downstairs, and she's not supposed to. So, let's see. We're gonna, um... We've got a couple of surprises, so... This is New Super Mario Brothers for the Nintendo DS. Now, I'm gonna have to figure out how to get in there. Maybe there's, like, a little slot that, where you can put a cartridge into it. Let's see. Let's see if this will go. Oh, it's an SD card slot. What put in there? Uh... No. Alright, yeah, I'm just gonna put it in here. Hopefully it doesn't get stuck, but... Yeah, let's try it. Really, yeah, I'm really tempting fate here. Huh? Yeah, I'm really tempting fate here. Reading... Yeah, I'm just gonna eject it because I don't know what's gonna say no this. So. Oh, there we go. So I think luckily it does come out, but it doesn't. It doesn't work. How about a? Where is? Where's my? What the heck? Oh, there we go. So let's try Mario Kart Seven for the Nintendo 3DS. I guess it goes in here to this side too. Nope. Alright, so once again, hopefully it won't get stuck. But yeah. Really tempting fate here. So it's reading. Yeah, nothing's happening, so 3DS games do not work. And luckily, it does come out, so. Um, yeah. One second, this went dark. Press that there. Oops. What am I doing? Alright, um, one more. I'm gonna, we're gonna try, um, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe for the Nintendo Switch. Let's see if it can recognize it. Let's see, does it go into the, does it go into the SD card slot? And, No, it's not, it's not even really good, it's not going in. Wait, wait, let's try now. Maybe it needs to, maybe it wasn't just enough, maybe there's just wasn't enough room. And yeah, no, it's not good, it's not going in, so. Once again, I hope it doesn't get stuck, but here we go. Reading, give it a few seconds to see if it does anything. And what are you doing down here? Yeah, she's not supposed to be down here, but I'm not going to worry about it. Yeah, and I can't see anything's happening, so I'm just gonna eject it. Alright, and luckily it does come out, so... But yeah, Nintendo Switch games do not work on the... Nintendo Switch games do not work on a Blu-ray player. Alright, so next, we're gonna try a VHS tape. This is Finding Nemo. Now, one second, I'm just gonna move picture here. Alright. Yeah, it needs to be room, so. Gonna put it there, and... Yep, and I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna shut it, and... Yeah. Alright, so that... So, yeah. Maybe it... See, so yeah, that didn't... So, yeah, I didn't take it. Let's try it. Let's try it one more time, just to see... Yeah, it says insert this side into the recorder, so... There. So let's just try it one more time to see if, any, if, it, if anything happens. So... Oops. Um... Yeah. How about, let's try, yeah, let's try it one more time just to see if anything does, if it does work. 
yeah, I'm done with that one. So yeah, VHS tapes, um, not only do they not work, they don't even fit. So yeah, VHS tapes don't work because they don't fit. Alright, last but not least, now you guys seen my other four in this videos. I really wanted your dollar bill. Let's see if we can add some money on here. Maybe buy a digital move. Maybe we can just buy a digital movie. You may think so I'm just gonna I guess we just put it like that. Yes. Yeah. Alright, let's see if it let's see if it takes it in. Let's just yeah, let's just see. Oops, nope. So yeah. Wait, one second. I'm gonna try to get oops, what out. Oh there we go. It went in. Maybe it will work. Let's see. Let's see, maybe, yeah, maybe we'll be, add, be able to add money to him um, so I can buy a, buy a, a, a digital movie. And I can't see that anything is happening, so I'm just going to eject it. Alright. Well, yeah, there we go. So, I'll get some of these pictures back. Um, I'm just going to put some of this stuff back. See, that is what happens when you put a foreign disc into a Blu-ray player. So only, so it's only, the only games that worked were the Xbox 360, the PC kind of, the music CD, the DVD, and obviously the Blu-ray. And then all the rest of these, they, they all, they all didn't work. So yeah guys, um, thank you for watching this video. If you did happen to enjoy, please give me a big fat thumbs up and that would be appreciated. And also guys, thank you so much for watching this video. And I will see you all Later. Goodbye.